Benson delay is finally here. It was announced on Chris Benson's Instagram page back in 1658. And uh, then a couple of wars happened and a couple of plagues as well. And then a world war and uh, economic collapse and another world war and then uh, the threat of nuclear war and then another plague. And um, then people said, well, it's Ukraine. And then Russia said, no, it's my crane. And now we're here in 2023 and the Benson delay is here. It's based on the PT2399 chip. Um, and it, it's, not, it's not analog, it's a digital delay, but it sounds mighty fine. And it's got a real nice, kind of tape echo feel to it. You have your normal delay controls here and then there is modulation here, uh, which you can obviously use for modulation, just modulation, um, if you turn down all the delay controls. And there is a hidden menu, a hidden menu, that can uh, set the waveform of the modulation and uh, depth division. So you can do dotted eighth, 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 eighth. eighth. It's, it's very hard for us Dutch to pronounce the th sound. Or sixteenth, six, six, oh my God. Uh, I have the Manitone Red Snapper turned on for just a little bit of party time. And I'm uh, gonna be playing my Heritage H150 Custom Core Custom Shop. Heritage is fantastic. Into the Silktone amp and uh, bus tube amp expander into the computer. And without a delay, it sounds like this. Turn up the volume a little bit. And this is with the delay. See how it fades off? It gets darker, but not like as gritty as an analog delay, but it has it has a soul. It sounds fantastic. You've tipped tempo. Brilliant. Um, the late times range from barely noticeable to I think more than a second. So you have like this really vintage vibey sounding delay with a very wide range of um, delay times. I could turn it up. So it's completely wet. So you can use that like in in a, in a wet dry setup or a wet dry wet setup. It's fantastic. Let's just leave it here. Just for a bit of awesomeness. So the modulation, let's turn everything off and engage the modulation. More mix.
so you can get that like faux chorus kind of thing, but with the delay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's turn down the depth a little bit. Let's dive into the menu. You press this button for two seconds and then you press this and then the LEDs start blinking and the pedal turns off, which is inconvenient because you press this to change the LFO waveform, but the pedal is turned off so you, so you can't hear what's happening. So then you turn on the pedal again by pressing this button for two seconds and you get the square or triangle waveform. Square. <laughs> it's Halloween almost, so let's do that. <laughs> okay, um, now we're gonna go to random. Uh, whew. No. I love a random, ran, random, random waveforms. Uh, and now let's check out. Let's go back to one. And this is dotted eighth. I mean, it sounds absolutely killer. And then you can also go to six sixteens. <laughs> It is a fantastic sounding delay. Um, plenty of features. My only problem with it is the menu. You, you have to dive in there and then you change something, but you can 
you can't hear what it's doing when you change the setting because the pedal turns off. Like the easiest solution would have been like a switch here and a switch there, changing the waveform, changing the tap divisions. But you know, I'm no engineer, so I don't know how hard it is, but from a user kind of perspective, that would have been a lot easier. So if you're like really into tap divisions and freaky stuff, there are better options out there. But if you just want a very, 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 very good sounding delay pedal, um, then yeah, <laughs> go, go for it. I'm gonna go for it. And I truly believe this is probably one of the best sounding digital analogish delay pedals out there. So very big thumbs up for Chris Benson. So let me know down below in the comments what your thoughts are. And uh, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel. Um, you can find my gem tracks on my Patreon page. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.